So guys, welcome to the must have Android apps episode which I spent a long time digging around to make sure I find applications that when you install are completely priceless. These are some of the apps that will completely change how you use your Android. With that being said, let's get right into the video. First in the list we have friends. Most of us use social media as a way of finding cool stuff to read on web. But whether you are using Twitter, Facebook, Reddit or anything else, it's not handled very efficiently on a phone. On the desktop, you can open links in their own background tab, queuing up several pages to read when you are ready. In mobile apps, you need to open and read one link at a time. Fling solves the problem. The app intercepts links and loads them in the background. When you are ready, each link can pop up on top of your current app so that you can read it and dismiss it. With virtually no interruption to what you are doing, with a pocket style save for later feature, Flinks is a revolutionary way of browsing on mobile devices. Next in the list we have Flipper. Widgets are awesome but they have their own limitations. You can place them on the home screen and you can only access them when your home screen is visible. Flipper makes them accessible everywhere via a small bubble tucked away on the edge of the screen. Tap the bubble and your chosen widgets will open. Want to control your music while typing in a document then you got no problem. Check the sports scores while playing a full screen game, done. Flipper puts Android devices one step closer to having full multitasking capabilities. Next up we have Notif. Android's notification shade is great for showing you what's happening in your apps. But you can use it to create notifications for your real life too. Notif is a twist on the to-do list app which you use to make lists, reminders, voice notes and more. And set them as actionable notifications. Tick off the items as you complete them or swipe the notification away when you are finished with it. The icon for each notification placed permanently on the status bar serves as a kind of digital knot in the handkerchief that constantly reminds you the jobs you need to complete. Next in the list is IF Triple T or call it IFT. If Magron is perfect for on-device automation, then IFT does the same for web services. Official IFT app enables you to create recipes that connect two internet-based services or devices with your Android phone as the central hub. The possibilities are most endless. You can use if to automatically tweet to get an SMS alerts for your Google Calendar appointments or to get notifications on the price drops for products you are looking to buy. Once you get it up and running, you'll wonder how you ever did without it. Next we have an app named PageF or PAGF. Basically it's an app which gives you paid apps for free in a legal way. It gives you all the information on the paid apps that are on sale for free in Play Store. The list gets updated within 24 hours and once you lose the offer you won't get it back. So after selecting the latest offer you will be redirected to the page where you will get to see all the apps available for free. All you have to do is select the app you want and it takes you to the Play Store from where you can install it. And mind you the apps stay free for a lifetime use. You don't have to pay even a single penny after you install it. It's free until you uninstall it from your device. Next up we have an app called Better Open With. We love the fact that you can replace the default Android apps with any other of your choosing. But sometimes you want to choose more than one app to handle particular types of file and link. With Better Open With, you can. This app replaces the standard Open With screen with something that is more powerful for two reasons. First, you can choose which apps will be offered to open link with. Reducing an often cluttered list to just one or two options. Second, better open with works on a timer. It opens on tapping a link but switches to the default after a couple of seconds if you don't want to make a choice. Next in the list we have Motion Stills. Motion Stills is an app from Google Research that lets you capture short videos and transform them into beautiful cinema graph or sweepings, cinematic pans using our Android stabilization and rendering technology. Creating looping GIFs or combined clips into movies that you can share with your friends. You can use still motions to capture a short 3 second clip with a simple tap or a condense up to a, to a minute of video into an essay to watch clip using the fast forward mode. Share your motion still as a looping GIFs or videos directly with your friends. Creating movies by combining clips with a simple swipe to write. Browse your recorded clips in a stream or flip through them one by one and watch them autoplay. Next up we have Imjur. Imjur brings you the world's latest entertaining content all in one app. Lift your spirits by geeking out the most best and humor gaming and best humor, cute, animal, nature, science and downright awesome viral images and gifs 
will find nowhere. You can use Imgur to find and enjoy the best images and GIFs from the topics you love most, connect with millions of people around the world, share awesome content with your friends and make them smile. Next in the list we have Universal Copy. Copy and paste on Android is mostly fine until it doesn't work. Some things just don't support it. Tweets for example or YouTube or Instagram descriptions. With Universal Copy, you can copy and paste almost anything from any app. It integrates seamlessly with the system. A long press is all you need to do for the option to copy your chosen text to the clipboard. After granting the required permissions, you will be able to see a notifications on your notification bar saying activate Universal Copy. And in case you want to copy the text in your home screen, select the notification and select the text you want to copy. Next up we have Min. Now this is a minimalistic icon pack for all those minimalist lovers out there. Designed to be small, Min can be used on its own or as a complement to another pack. It has over 1500 icons, multiple launcher support like Nova, Apex, Action, Smart and others. And it has over 50 plus minimalistic wallpapers. It also has an option for various icon alternatives. The app always to update. This app can take your Android customization to a whole lot newer level if used properly. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video. As always, I've got tons of stuff like this. So make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell button. With that being said, this is Freak Tech signing off. Thank you.